This is Robert Kraft, and I'm your host on SNN Network. And joining me right now is Mars Gordon. He is the president and CEO of Wallbridge Mining. It's a publicly traded company. The symbol is WM on the TSX. And Wallbridge will be participating at the upcoming Precious Metal Summit Beaver Creek, a hybrid event happening this year on September 8th through the 11th. With that, Mars, thank you so much for joining me today. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Thanks, Robert, for uh, for inviting us and do another interview. I think the last time we met was about a year ago this time. So, so Mars, last time we had you on, uh, as you just alluded to, it was about a year ago. Uh, we published that interview on August 18, 2020. So let's get an update. You know, what, what would you say are some of the highlights from the company in the last 12 sure. months? So the last time we met, in fact, we were in the midst of uh, defining the size potential of Fennel Longwall. As you, as you all know, last, last year we talked about the purchase of Fenelon property from Balmoral Resources and then the acquiring Balmoral Resources in 2020 and now controlling this uh, over 900 square kilometer land package on the Sunday Lake Deformation Zone, which is really an underexplored belt in the Abitibi. So far identified three gold systems. One is at Detour Mine, one is at Fenelon and one at Martinier where Balmoral had already come up with the resource estimate. So uh, we've been quite busy uh, following up on the original size potential of Fenelon, and we did some infill drilling in the first half of this year, in 2021, in order to deliver the maiden resource that we had uh, the, uh, promised to the market that is going to come out by the end of September this year. And uh, that maiden resource, we believe it's going to be a multi-million ounce uh, deposit, and we believe that it's going to have a component of the underground as well as open pit. But more importantly, we also uh, announced about a month ago that we started the uh, in the second half of the year, we'd like to do some regional exploration as well. So we not only are going to come up with the maiden resource and also show as a starting stone, uh, step stone, if you may, at Fenelon with the future updates in the future. Uh, so, so there is organic growth in there. But more importantly, there is this large land package that we've now focused on a few of our uh, you know, targets, one being at Martinier, which we have already a drill started over the past three weeks, one at Cassol, which is the uh, property that we optioned from Midland. And then uh, those two drills will carry out the regional exploration drilling going from, uh, from Cassol then to Grasset, uh, looking for the gold potential at Grasset as well. Uh, this year's plan was about 170,000 meters. Uh, we think that we're going to be in the 150 to 170,000 meter range. Uh, and, and with that, we also had decided to do some underground development in this year, partly to de-risk the project. You know, this, uh, there's 20 to 30 years of overburden in here, and we want to make sure we don't make the mistakes of the past by other companies when they, you know, they do all of the capital uh, expenditures on just drill hole information. We wanted to get underground, touch and feel some of these areas, like in Area 51 and Tabasco Cayenne zones. And that's why uh, this year's program is going to complete about 2,500 meters of that 10,000 meter underground development program as well. In terms of the, uh, our, our, our cash position, at the end of the second quarter, we had over $71 million in Canadian uh, cash in our treasury. Uh, with this year's program of between 150 to 170,000 meters, 2,500 meters of underground development drilling, maiden resource, about 20,000 of that in terms of meters would be on regional exploration, as well as all of our corporate expenditures with the required studies that are that we're completing this year, we're still going to be left with between 30 to 40 million dollars Canadian at the end of this year. So we have a lot of flexibility for next year's program. We think that next year program will not only include Fenelon, but we're hoping that we actually, based on the gold system that we see at Martinier, we may add additional drills at Martinier to be able to hopefully replicate what we did at Fenelon at Martinier as well. So, so, so there's a lot of flexibility with our program as well as our funding. So uh, with that, where can our audience go and find more information on Wallbridge? Uh, www.wallbridgemining.com. Uh, we do have a social media. We have a YouTube channel for Wallbridge mining which is uh, you know all of our videos my videos and any other information that Wabridge has is posted on that uh, any technical information you'd be able to go on cedar.com under the Wabridge uh, mining name and be able to uh, to get any of our uh, you know disclosures that have been uh, done in the past so so and also we do have our twitter our, our instagram as well as uh, as well as on linkedin uh, all of our posts would be there so so please visit those you're fully uh, socially connected there. I like it. Absolutely. All right. All right. Well, Mars, thank you so much for joining me today. I really do appreciate it. Good luck. Stay safe. And I look forward to our next update. Thank you very much. Take care. Thank you. Again, my name is Robert Kraft, and I'm your host on SNN Network. And we're a proud media sponsor for the upcoming Fresh Metal Summit Beaver Creek hybrid event this year happening September 8th through the 11th. 
Wallbridge will be there participating. Thank y'all for watching.